What's going on, guys? It's a me, Big Mill Twenty One. As you can see, I uh, I got my Mario hat on because uh, uh, because I just want to wear the Mario hat. There's no other way to say it. But it's a me, Mario. Uh, it's a me, Big Mill. What's going on? Uh, I, we're back here for some more Persona. This is Park Eleven. Last thing we did was well, we did the dark uh, what do you call it? the dark hour uh, uh, the full moon event. We took out the uh, the two shadows there, and now we have a chance to go. Uh, we have a chance to go back into Taurus. And what I like to do, me personally, is I like to uh, go ahead and go through Taurus as much as I can, so I don't have to worry. So I can like separate it, uh, separate the Taurus from the uh, socialize. It's just how I like to do it. But anyway, um, we gonna go ahead and go into it. Uh, there's nothing else really to say, so let's just go right into it. I hope you, I know you guys are having fun watching it, and I, I'm having fun playing it. So let's just go enjoy it. Before we do, uh, before we go get into it, uh, of course, as always, if you guys enjoy this playthrough or this video, you can go ahead and like, share, or and subscribe so you don't miss any other other videos I have coming out. And make sure you hit the bell because sometimes. Couple of videos don't go go down the pipeline. Is you know it, it gets caught up into somewhere else and into the YouTube netherworld or whatever it is. So <laughs> uh, let's just get right into it. And uh, yeah, all right, here we go. So now let's see. Let's sure we start with first. Now that uh, now I want to go into Tartarus as soon as possible, but the problem is um. I want to wait a couple days before I do that, just so I can get a chance to get some potent medicine. Uh, I'm not sure when exactly I can do that, but uh, you know, probably soon. Probably soon. Anyway, Masuru, there's an exclamation mark above you. Kind of think of it, Elizabeth asked me to get a specific item for her. Hmm? You are looking for a triangular sword. Is that supposed to be a riddle? I'm not sure what you mean. Hmm, a triangular object used for dueling. By any chance, are you talking about a Finson Epi? Did I said that correctly? Epi? 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 I'm gonna just say Epi. It's not a triangle sword. No, but the cross section does resemble a triangle. Let me retrieve mines for you. Please. A fencing Epi. Here you go. Do you plan on taking up fencing? If so, I can teach you a thing or two once I have some spare time. No, I'm not trying to learn a fence. I'm trying to get something for a girl as well. Uh, hmm? Mr. Ekodo's punishment. Oh, the teacher. Where there are some things in life you don't want to know. This is one of them. What do you do to him? Uh, what do you do to that teacher? That poor teacher. Jeez. I guess you got pool as class president? The student president? I'm sure you are really feeling it. But the enemies are steadily growing more powerful. Don't be satisfied with how you are now. Work on improving your strengths. If you wait until after a tough battle, it'll be too late. Uh, yeah, thanks for the words and encouragement. Always. What you reading? You reading a manga? What is that? Uh, instruction? Is that art book? That reminds me. Yamagishi Kun is surprisingly skilled with technologically. And she's very kind, always considering others' feelings. Her name suits her perfectly. Who means wind and ka means flower. So wind flower. Like flower gently blowing in the hmm, getting off track there. In the wind, yes, I get it. I don't know why you sat off there. Uh can I help you? Uh let's talk. Living in the dorm is kinda exciting, isn't it? Settling into a new room with all my old stuff is a nice change of pace. I'm struggling a bit trying to rearrange things though. But honestly, I'm just glad I get to live here with all of you. That's cool. We got, we got a new member now. That's great. Oh, it's nice having food game. Dude, I almost got in trouble with the police today. <laughs> what happened? I was damn lucky it was just a false alarm. Uh, what the hell happened? By the way. I guess all that talk about Fuga being sick wasn't true. At first. People were saying that she was absent because she was being bullied. But then they started saying she was really sick. Yeah. Strange. Huh? She seemed pretty healthy to me. Oh, yeah, but can I put my thing in the freezer? Refrigerator. 616, so two days to now. I, sh I guess I'll wait 
I should I I'll wait till like six sixteen ish ish. Uh okay, so what's the what can I do? The wild duck we can uh I kinda wanna kinda need some I don't know when the next exam is, but I don't I don't like my thing sitting on two all that much. So uh Yeah, let's study. Study now. Yeah, I'm feeling smart. So smart. You know what I'm saying? So goddamn smart. Ugh. I love studying. I hate studying, but you gotta study anyway. Morning. Morning. Uh, I guess it's true that there have been fewer cases of apathy syndrome after our missions. But then again, that changes as we get closer to the next full moon. By the way, what do you think of Kurijo Senpai? What? Well, that was out of the blue. What do you mean? Like, is she hot? Yeah, yes. she hot. Don't you think she should have pushed Fuga into joining too quickly? I know it's like having more Persona users around, especially in battle, but... Are you, like... I, 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 I don't know. You probably having some type of emotional problems something just doesn't feel right i don't know maybe she just another maybe she just don't like having another female member i don't know i can't tell you right, I'm gonna keep going. anyway you're in school now mr tori yumi hello there our language can be awfully complex don't you hate when you know the meaning of a word but you can't remember the word itself this feels like a good time for a spontaneous question. Let's see. Iori's shifting in his seat a bit too much, so instead. Listen. How about you, Dark? Oh, me? Which phrase means able to see things for what they really are? Uh. Mean eye, bright eye, keen eye. A keen eye. You gotta have a keen eye. That's correct. You may very well have, have a keen eye yourself. Having a, <clears throat> ah. having a keen eye means you are able to see things for what they really are. It can also help you make good decisions for your future. That goes for the rest of you, too. You need to learn how to look past the surface. Otherwise, you're going to be superficial. I answer correctly. <laughs> oh, oh. Hell, what was in my throat? I answer correctly. Everyone looking at me with respect. That's right. I'm a smart student. I I have a keen eye myself, you know what I'm saying? Very keen. Uh, just saying. Okay. I need some medicine. I'm glad it won't be a full move for a while, but still, I can't help thinking about it. I need some medicine. Are you psyched now that Fuka joined the team? Hell yeah. Definitely. Yeah, man, I'm totally stoked. Oh man, part of this is going to be a breeze when we go in there. Oh, uh, something for me. I got something for you. Consider a restitution for today and the work for others. Uh, I don't think you have something new. I think he just saved that. That's like a sell every Monday. Um, should I go? Yeah, I think I should go. Let me save it though. I haven't saved since I started. Uh, go to student council. Talk about some, uh, I don't know, paper clips, whatever the hell we talk about in student council. I think we talk about paper clips. Okay. How many times do I have to explain it? It's like I'm talking to a moron. What? Why would you even accuse me? The cigarette butt was in the boys' bathroom, right? Are you so on about the cigarette butt? Girl who brought it and left it there? <sighs> with that logic, this is never gonna end. I'm done with this. You're on your own. Wait, wait that's a secondary. Are you accusing our own people? <sighs> Punch in the Wow. I hope you ain't gonna accuse me next. 
Uh, they're the worst. Bunch of Neanderthals. They think like children. They just can't help it. Someone kills me, bro. Sooner or later, they'll see the light. Then I'll earn their trust. And they'll learn to respect me. I don't mean to isolate myself. I'm just remaining detached. Someone always gets hurt in any relationship sooner or later. Oh man, you got some trust issue, don't you? It's okay. It's okay. I suppose I've gone on long enough. I, I apologize. It's okay. Oda. <laughs> Oda. I feel like I understand him a little better now. I really don't, but hey. There we go. At rank five, student council. No point in having a meeting today if no one else is here. Let's go. All right. Yeah, there, there, there's that. There's that. Welcome back. Hmm. Um, I suppose. A weapon of choice is the Thrustness Sword. It was once used to settle duels in Europe. It's a powerful and accuracy, and accuracy may be average, but it's a reliable weapon with no particular downside. <laughs> I personally do not like to gamble with the effectiveness of my weapon. This is ideal for me. Uh, cool. Uh, let's see. Um, as you may know, my persona is called Lucia. I actually don't know. I have to look at your your, your, your persona thing. Since I specialize in detecting enemies and processing information, my job is to provide everyone support. So, while I can't confront enemy directly like you do, I still do whatever I can to help out the team. Uh, yeah, let me look at it right now. Uh, persona. Full analysis. Like a saint. Lucia, a saint who was martyred during the persecution of Christianity in the time of the Roman Empire. She was tortured and had her eyes gorged out, but miraculous, a miraculous restore her sight. She is revered as the patron saint of the blind. Oh. Uh, I, that's, that's... That's messed up. Uh, full of NASA reveals the affinities of one foe. And jamming. Prevents detection by any by enemies by entering battles or change of force. Oh, okay. Uh, and let's check out Luigi while we're here. Oracle grants one random positive effect to all allies. Hey. And personality. After analyzing an enemy, her yearning for her friends first grows. So just analyze then. Let's see what's mine. Cadenza restore 50% HP and by the accuracy slash evasion for all allies. After summoning a persona with uh, power, we're then gradually enhance this. Uh, cool. Cyclone arrows, the, the deal severe wind. That's what we did. We already saw that already. After healing someone, her desire to prevent death strengthens, so heal. Uh, hack and blast. Deal severe slash damage to one foe, ignoring resistance. After landing a critical hit, he became motivated by his own potential. Cool. So, critical. Let's see, Akihiko, uh, after strengthening, strength, strength, strengthening himself and his fighting spirit uh, rises. So uh, he got like buff. He got like use buff. Uh -huh. uh, lightning spike, heavy electric damage to all foes and uh, annoying resistance, low chance to shock. And Misuru, Blizzard Edge, severe ice damage to one foe, ignoring if resistance is high chance to freeze. That's pretty good. After weakness, weakening enemies or inflicting an ailment, her will burns brighter. Got you. Alrighty, uh, let me take a look at it, right? I got you. Ah, oh, she kind of strong. Kind of strong. Kind of, just kind of. Like, really strong. Nice. Kuko will be supporting us. Uh, she has the voice of an angel. Don't get me wrong. Kurijo Senpai has a nice voice too. It's just that Fuka is just so calm and soothing. Yeah. Misery was just like... It's, 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 it's demanding, but sexy demanding. Kirijo Senpai was doing support and now she will be fighting with us. Most of us can only do one or the other, but she can do both. She can really do anything, huh? Sound like you're jealous. 
I don't know, Yukari. What do you want me to say? What do you want me to say? Uh, let's go to part-time job. Let's do that. Well, uh, actually, time to run the prank game. Oh, prank game. Uh, Ganesha Bank. Let's do that. Let's do that. I, I'm going to need three Jack Frost dolls at one point. I don't know if I have it. I think I have two. Maybe. I got to I got to double check that. Can I check my items? I, oh, I have three. Never mind. I have three already. Yay. <laughs> Good. I don't have to worry about that shit later. Um... Oh, and one more thing. I want to check to see if there is something I can go get for uh, Miss I mean, for Elizabeth. By the way, I just got a designer pair of glasses in stock. Not only they hit, but they even work with a more feminine style. But if you could spare 150, that is. 150. Although, if you bring me a black wood, maybe you adjust the price. It's an extremely real collector, I see. Anyway, it's up to you how much you want to give up for these glasses. A black quartz. I wonder if someone had like gemstone. Come to think of it, the shadows and tutter some drop some gemstone. A little bit might know something some about time. it. Uh so I can buy for like So I can buy for like uh 150 yen. I only got 40. Boy, you out of your mind. I'm out of here. I'm out. I only get paid about a certain amount. Alright. Here you go. Part time. Part time fun. I dealt with housewife complaining about the Fernon coffee again. Complaining about the coffee. The coffee. Nobody don't ever complain about the cakes or nothing, just the coffee. Oh, there you are. Good timing. Oh, shoot. <laughs> that was an accident. Good timing. There's something I have to tell you. From now on, you no longer need my permission to go to Tartarus. Why? Because Yamagishi can provide support. If she's present, you won't need my help. But I did tell her not to let you go if both Akiiko and I are not available. I'm just worried something unexpected may happen. So please keep that in mind. One more thing, could you set aside some time tonight? It won't take too long. All right, then, I'll see you later. All right, cool. All righty, then. Uh, have it your way. Ah, uh, see, I see Keji here. What's going on? Uh, hang out with no, I can't, I can't hang out with you, but uh. Yeah. See, I can hang out with baby. Mm. Grab some ramen. Uh, I don't see what reason why not to. Yeah, let's hang out, kid. Uh, oh. Ah. Oh, I forget. There we go. Mm. Grab some ramen. All right. Let's go. Guess I go get myself an extra large special. Wow, let's really think about something, huh? Huh? Uh, what? Sorry, man, but I've got a pass this time. What do you mean you got a pass? We were gonna get some ramen. Just like that? Yeah, just like that. I'm just so torn. I really do want to hang out with you. 
Oh no, you, 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 yeah, you, you bullshit. Can you? No, no time for ramen today. I gotta go check out that cram school. Oh, oh, I'm about what I mean. You should have said so from the beginning. I mean, getting into college is pretty important, don't you think? You think about the future too, right? Yeah, you should have mentioned that before the ramen, bro. I was starving for some ramen. Uh, yeah. yeah. Uh, not even a little. I got plans already. Uh, I got plans already. Oh, dude, I didn't know you were so serious about your future. Mm, yeah, bro. I, I got plans. I really thought about my future until Emiri told me I should. She said I'd end up a loser if I didn't. Oh, so your girlfriend told you that? Then that was happen, huh? Oh. Uh, the future's a long way off. I mean. I still have to go to college first, right? You should have seen, you know, you know, you should have done that before asking me out for some ramen. But that's cool. Apparently, a bunch of Emiri students go to good colleges. She must be thinking about our future together. You ought to think about your future too, man. I'd hate to see you end up becoming a loser, you know? Same, likewise, I hate to see you becoming a loser that's too. We gotta work our asses off for our futures. Alrighty then. Toma Chica seems to be sincerely worried about my future. It's like my relationship is strong. Nah, seriously. If you cared about my future, I care about his future. Don't be a loser. Later. I'm heading to cram school. Alrighty. I went back to the door myself. Alrighty then. Kenji, I ain't like that. He blew me off. The hell is his problem? Welcome back. With that, we have all the second years present. So, what exactly are we all here for? Ah, I had planned to give Yamagishi a tour of the dorm. Oh, we're doing a tour. But I realized I never actually showed it properly to any of you since you moved in. <laughs> oh, we're getting a tour, yeah. I apologize for that. I'd like to take this opportunity to make it up to you all. Yeah, let's go with a, a, a dorm tour. Let's go. I want to see all the places. Show us everything, Miss Sue. I want to see everything. Sounds good. It may be a, a three months late, but still. I've been living here all this time. I think we get the picture by now. If any one of us needs it, it's you. Oh, shut up. You realize if you screw around and break something, you'll get us all in trouble, right? Oh, shut up, Yukari. Let's get this tour on the road. Come on, I'm getting by just fine. In fact, I know the place so well, I could give you a tour myself. <laughs> You'll make a great assistant then. No, I'm the assistant. Screw Junpei. Humor me a bit, won't you? With the increase in members, I'd like to expand our access to facilities. Expand? Wait, new stuff? Sweet! So what, are we gonna get like hot springs? Maybe a casino? You, know. you are so stupid. <sighs> we'll just have to see now, won't we? With that, let's begin. Yamagishi, follow me. Oh, okay. Thank you for setting this up for me. Damn it, Yukari. God damn it. This is the communal kitchen. Oh, hey, I was going to put my food in the fridge. Can't do it now. Wow, looks so clean now. I didn't realize the kitchen was so big. I was planning to do this earlier, but with April's shadow attack and ensuing investigation, I just couldn't find time. It should be far more accessible now. You're free to use any of the kitchenware here. You all cook your own meals? We can use a kitchen now, sweet. I've seen Akihiko in here from time to time. As for myself, I can't say I do. Mm -hmm. We used to have someone who cooked with some frequency, but... Oh, no. I think of it, I only ever come here to get hot water. What about you? Uh, I don't cook, bro, but I like to cook. Yeah, I like to eating a balanced diet there's no better way than to cook it yourself just don't eat my food bro but it's not as cheap as they make it out again it's 
hard to use everything up before it goes bad. Wow, Yukari-chan. Does that mean you know how to cook? Huh? Oh, I mean, I can do it, I guess. But I'm no chef. It's been a while, and I've had my fair share of embarrassments. But with a kitchen this big, I think a couple people could work together in here. I'm bad, you know, sometimes you make mistakes while cooking. As long as you know how to clean up after is all that's good. That's all that matters. Trust me, I had a load of, um, you know, I always felt like I almost burned a house down a couple of times when cooking. But, you know, I always keep my eye on what's going on and, you know, all that matters. We can have the work, but double the flavor, you know? I should try it next time. I invite someone to cook. We can use the kitchen to make something. Ah, oh, cool. Moving right along then. Here's where we all head. The living room, yay. This is the lounge. Well, I suppose it requires no further explanation. Wait, is that a DVD player? When did that get here? Oh, wait. Oh, that's mine. Hey, she got the DVD. I brought it with me from home. Bit of an old model, though. You can all watch Dr. Doolittle now. Uh, thanks. It's no problem at all. It was a broken one to begin with. But I was able to fix it. So, I hoped you all might get some use out of it. The sofas here are pretty comfy. It'd be a perfect place to sit back and watch. Oh, maybe this would be a good place. Some movies I've been wanting to see, but I'd rather not watch them alone. What's this? Is Yucatan afraid to watch horror flicks? Oh, we're gonna watch Alien together. It's quite a shocker to see your soft side. Hard to imagine you're even the same person. I'll be. I would love to see Yukari watch Alien. I want her to scream. You know. And what exactly is that supposed to mean? I swear. <laughs> You've got some nerve, Junpei. Boy, I can, I can, yeah, I, I don't know if I can, but some people, if you can stand Junpei and Yukari bickering, for me, this is my last, this is my last lake. I can't stand it. They bicker too much. It's not even a bad thing Junpei doing. She just, she just she can't stand. A joke or two. I I don't know. I I hate I hate I hate females like Jukari. I honestly do. They're good people. They're really good people. But it's just you know they can just yeah, one wrong one wrong quibble and it's like you know your whole day for me. You know what I'm saying? By the way, I'm like blocking people. There we go. I don't want to. I didn't realize I was blocking everybody. You better watch your back next time we go to Tartarus. Yukari-chan, you're kind of scaring me. And hey, you're scaring Fuka. You gotta chill out. <laughs> I could probably watch a DVD with someone here. Ooh. That wraps up the first floor. Let's move up to the next. Oh, by the way, Kirijo senpai are we allowed to borrow those books on the shelf in the back? Of course. Those books were donated by residents of the dorm. I peruse them from time to time myself. This area is pretty sweet. Nice and quiet. And let me tell you, those chairs are mwah, soft. Oh, yeah. Perfect, comfortable chairs for reading. Definitely. When I cozy up here with a good book, I end up reading way late into the night. All you read is manga. Manga is a respectable form of literature. Maybe I'll try reading here as well. Thank you, Fuka. Thank you. She 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 is a cultured. She's very cultured. Unlike someone else. People are always coming and going from the lounge, so I could see this place being less distracting. Hey. 
I think I'd be able to focus and read a book here. Yeah. Please utilize it however you'd like. Any piece of literature is a means of broadening one's horizons. Aye, aye, Captain. Just one thing, Iori. When you finish a manga, put it back on the shelf. I don't want to see them piled up on tables and chairs. Oh. Oh. You're one of those type of readers, huh? <laughs> uh, get your books back, bro. Keep an eye on Junpei so he doesn't make a mess of this place. Let's keep moving on then. I still like you, Kari. We did keep you just, the top uh, off limits, but recently decided to open it up. Well, this is my buff potato sprout garden. I hope you guys like it. I put a lot of work into it. The chairman wanted to start a small garden here. Wow! I had no idea there was something like this up here. Is it for growing vegetables? Or potatoes. Oh boy, I can hear him now. Eat your veggies, peas. Not funny when you say it. That sounds about right. With a terrible smirk plastered on his face. I hear you're the one taking care of it. Uh, yes, I, I take good care of these potatoes. You know, I water them, I look at them, I stare at them, I talk to them, I, uh, I joke with them. I make sure they're feeling all pretty good and everything. That's how you, you know, supposed to take care of plants, right? That's what you get a green hand from. Looks like it's shaping up quite nicely. The chairman was right to put you in charge. Uh, you okay doing this all on your own? Uh... Can you some help? Why don't you help him out, Junpei? It's not like you've got anything better to do. <laughs> yeah, I definitely saw that one coming. <laughs> but I guess it does look kind of fun. I don't get how Junpei just like put up with it. I seriously don't understand how he just like, you know, he don't. I don't understand, bro. I would have spazzed out on her day one and she was talking to me like that i'm just saying i'm not a bad I'm, I'm not a mean guy a bad guy but i just can't let people talk to you talk to me a certain way you know it's a it's a mutual respect thing respect thing so maybe all the vitamins from the veggies will make my skin all as silky smooth <laughs> that would be a sight to see the more time and care you put into this kind of work the better the results. Cooperating with someone on this may be worth your time. I might be a bit interested as well. Having someone help me with the garden might affect the end result. What is this? Somebody can help me guarding now. Let's head back down. And that concludes the tour. Yay, the tour is over shown around kind of makes me feel more motivated to make use of those places did you get all that anything you're still unclear about i got everything down yukari are you going to re tell me everything over again because i would like that good to hear i hope your stay here is an enjoyable one as long as all of us remain considerate the dorm will continue to be a comfortable living space for all. If there's anything you'd like to do here, you may want to invite the others to join you. Yeah, we're all living under the same roof after all. Better make the most of it. I've never really done anything like this before, so I'm a little nervous. I'll try my best to enjoy myself here with you all. This may be coming a little late for most of you, but welcome to the dorm. All right. All right, we got a proper tour. All righty. Great, and looks like everyone's already. What's this? Oh. Hey, Dark. One of the girls in my class let me borrow a DVD of this show she's been watching. I was thinking about watching it in my room, but since it might be better to watch it out here, it's just the TV is bigger. Spend the time with your peers in the dorm. At night, you'll have some time to spend with your party members. Doing so might lead to some inter interesting revelation. 
Sometimes these discoveries can be helpful in battle, so don't be shy about approaching your teammate. Uh, yeah, watching this DVD, you probably might improve my charm. Uh, oh, what's up? You wanna watch it? Uh, let's see about that. Let's see about that. I gotta, everybody's kind of feeling something. I'm sure you already feel it, but the enemies are still growing more powerful. Don't be satisfied with how your strengths are now. Work on improving your strength if you want. Did you say this to me already? Uh, I know you put this in here. There's a bit of space. Yes, chill this lukewarm. I swear to God, if it's getting taken by somebody, I'm going to, uh, I'm going to I'm gonna have a stern word with, with Miss Ru about it. Oh, it's you. Do you have some time to spare right now? Now that the kitchen has been cleaned up, I was considering putting it to use. I have to have some quality tea leaves from the company head. I'll be happy to serve you a cup. Uh, what do you say? I, I see. might do that? Um, um, yes, can I help you? Uh, what are you doing? Um, Undark, is it right if I tend to the rooftop planners too? I actually be interested in the garden for a while if you don't mind, I can join you. Tend to the vegetable garden with friends while you gardening alone. Vegetable can help me, uh, Raising vegetables with the help of your friends will result in a more plentiful harvest. Veggie grease with the help of those, uh, take on different effects depending on who you are, or who you are gardening with. Uh, sheesh, I might do that. I might do that. Uh, let's see. Junpei at the books. Man, look, it's like they only got educational manga. I was hoping for some shonen stuff. Ah, well, at least I still have that one I borrowed from what's his name. If you want to give it a read too, it's this baseball manga that finished up a while back. Uh, reading the baseball manga will help improve my courage. Come on, let's read it. <laughs> Actually, you know, I'm going to do the, do the gardening because it's going to be really helpful. It's going to be really helpful. When I go to Targers. So this is what it's like growing plants. Oh, should we be measuring the pH of the soil or monitoring how much sunlight they're getting? pH. Um, it's like a measurement of acidity or alkalinity. Oh, uh, okay. Depending on the plants you're growing, the soil needs to be a certain value. I looked up a bunch of stuff online. I thought it might be helpful. Oh, no, it's helpful. Yeah. Green, green hand and all that. But I've never really worked with them outside of arrangements. I've always wanted to try putting in the work to grow some, though. Oh, sorry. I, I didn't mean to go on about myself like that. Shall we keep working for a bit more? I'll go get some water. I really like Fuka, bro. Like, she is so... A, it's a joy to have her around. Charming. Uh, nice. Cute. Like, I gotta say. She like, she probably, like, like, not useful in battle, per se. But, you know. As a character, she's, like... She, like, like top three. Easy. I mean... It's only like really like but so far it's only like three girls so <laughs> she would be top three but you know top two attend at the rooftop planet with food ah this looks good do you think you could invite me when you tend the plants again i'll do more research so i'm in a better position to help out next time too all right, we got better, uh, better harvest, more plentiful greens. Oh boy, ah, that was a long night. I can hear people talking. Hi. Hey, did you hear? It? There's an opening in the art club. Really? Seriously? Really? Did someone transfer school? But it sounds interesting. I'm tired of going straight home. Maybe it's time to join the club. Let's go check it out after school then. Bro, I'm in like... I'm in like five different clubs already. Maybe I can learn more about if, if I visit a cl club room. Bro, I, I, I've been in like so many clubs already. 
I can't do too many things at once. You know what I'm saying? Oh no, it's this guy again. Oh my god, he's gonna teach us about some weird type of whatever. All right, let's begin. Palace around a Xenomas. We all need to start somewhere. Rome wasn't built in a day. The same goes for magic. You ought to learn its background. Today, I'll teach you about the origin of magic. Oh no. Magic. Long, long ago, at the dawn of civilization, man created primitive religions. Animism, totemism, and shamanism all fall into this category. You learn these in the world history, right? That last one, shamanism, is important to the origins of magic. A shaman will fall into a trance state and act as the intermediary between the worlds, but it counts as magic when humans can have the power of gods and spirits in their own hands. This shaman style magical tradition would later be embraced by witches. Take the common European witch as an example. People today think that witches derive their power from contracts with the devil. But that's just Christian propaganda. The witches predecessors was more like maidens serving the gods. It was through prayer to these guys that they earned their powers. They learned to control their magic without losing consciousness during their trance state. That's how they originally awoke to the practice. Originally, Europe was full of religions, worshipping a slew of various gods. The collective term for them is paganism. Interestingly enough, the celebrations of Christmas and Halloween had pagans background. Uh, are you all still paying attention? No trans states for now. Eh he 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 eh he eh he eh. Here's a test to see if you are paying attention. Oh, you're quizzing us. Get it wrong and your afterlife won't be pleasant. Palace around a Xenomans. Okay, now who should I pick? I choose the dark me. What? What early religion practice was the origin of magic? Uh Shamanism, animalism, wasn't it sh all of these things? Shaman? Very good. You'll be born in your next life as a human. Oh, I got it right. But all three of those things what you mentioned at the same time. Oh, was that a trick question? You're being you're being tricky. Itogawa, you're a tricky, tricky person. Anyway, let me uh do this. So paganism and Christianity have a closer connection to than one might think. As the Roman Empire grew, so did the Christian population within the empire. At first, each religion practiced separately without issue. But I answer correct. Oh, he's done. Everyone looking at me with respect. Yeah, you know, he's, he was going to go on and on and on and on that about witches and de and gods and deities and temples and and this and that and oh my god, bro. Oh. All right, class ended. Apparently, the art club is recruiting new members. I might be able to learn more about them if I visit the club room. Uh, guess I go to the art club. Oh, uh, what is the art club? Uh, it's like everybody's out. Everybody's out and about. Everybody's out and about. Okay, this is the art club. Art room. There's a note that says art club. New members welcome to color the world. Uh, let's join the club. Let's join. Hey, is Fuka in the club room too? Look at that. Um, you're not a member of this club, are you? Do you know him, Yamigishi-san? Oh, yes. He's the one I was just telling you about. Ah, so he's the one, huh? You was talking about me? Which I was talking about. I've heard a lot about you from Yamigishi-san. We're looking for new members to join our club, so I mentioned you. 
I'm really happy you decided to stop by on your own. And, um, I'm Keisuke Hiraga. Pleased to meet you. So, can I join the art club? I want to get my art on. He should be the one introducing himself to you, Keisuke Senpai. You're the club leader, aren't you? Yeah, I am. Still the same as ever. Huh? Yamagishi-san is back, and now we're getting a new member. Maybe I should be a little more active here. What you don't art you don't paint or nothing? What you do here? Wait, aren't you a third year Hiroga Senpai? Don't you have entrance exams coming up? No, I uh Don't worry about that. Hey, do you have an eye for art? Oh uh, okay. I should just be I should just be a good guy and so say yeah kinda. I don't wanna be a a, a, a dick. Or a stick in the mud. Yeah, I don't have time to do. <laughs> then maybe we'll get to learn a thing or two from you. Meeting you like this can't be just a coincidence. It must be fate. Let's get you signed up, shall we? I'm signed up. Yeah. At least I have Puka in the art club I'm with. You know, at least it's somebody here I am cool with. That makes passing time so much easier. Oh look, another, another, th th this thing. I am Dao, thought of I, thou established a new bond. What are you, like, the art, the art of Kana? The fortune, you are the fortune. Oh, I wonder why. It said good things comes in uh, fortune. I, th I think. I, I think I'm using a different term. I think I'm missing two different terms together. So don't forget to turn in your registration form. The art club meets on Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays. Tuesday, Wednesdays, and Thursdays. Uh, at least they like break back, by, by back to each other. Leading up to exams, we should be studying then anyway. You don't have to come every day, so just try to show up every now and then. Who would have thought we'd end up in the same club? Ah, oh, no, me too. Who would have thought that? It was okay. I'll now it's me. Process. Looking forward to painting with you. It's a me, Mario. I'm sorry. I just had. I felt the need to say it again. <laughs> Um, after joining the club, I decided to go back to the door. Here we go. We're back to the door. Can I get some medicine? I've been stalling Tartarus because I want some medicine. I want some medicine. Oh, you're back. Should we head to Tartarus later? We have some time before the next full moon, but the enemy are growing strong too. So I like to train with Polydeuces even more. How about it? The way I had this, this is going right now. We might need to go to Tartarus a little bit later. Just a little bit. Can I help you? Uh, can you? Junpei Kun said you're playing an online game. Is that true, Dark? Uh, yeah. I like games. Oh, so you can play with people from all over the world, right? It's great that the internet is able to connect all kinds of people. Maybe I should give it a try. You really that into, uh... Internet, huh? Huh. It seems certain clubs have been actively recruiting new members. Oh, but you're already in a club, aren't you? Well, there's no rule against joining multiple clubs. Feel free to join any that pique your interest. Juggling studies, club activities, and shadows won't be easy, but it surely builds character. Yeah, I guess. I, I, I just want some medicine. I don't I don't really care for all of that. Infused persona. Hey, do you think apathy syndrome can be cured? Maybe. I mean, you just go to the doctor, right? To hear that up. Oh, maybe. Yeah, maybe if we detect the shadow, the spirit it ate will return to the owner. But then again, they might just get digested. Maybe. I don't know what that conversation was even about. Hey, do you know how to cook? I have to eat through. I have to eat enough to make up for what I've been burned during the training. So it ended up being a lot of food. Either this is just cook it all at once. I appreciate your help if you have the time. Uh, looks like Sonai wants me to cook with him. 
I might as well hit this. I might as well. I don't see there's anybody messaging me. My job ain't calling. This is a staple for an apple, full of valuable nutrients and not too hard to cook either. The problem is what comes after. Next, you gotta portion everything out and then put it in the freezer. It's a lot of work. Sounds like a pain. The protein powder's not enough. You sure work hard. Uh, you sure work hard, bro. Just lazy, so I want to do everything in one go. Ah, uh, a, a, a man of culture like me, I understand. If I want to get stronger, I have to do whatever it takes. I, I, I do things to the point where I can do them efficiently, but lazy at the same time. Cause you know what, I am a lazy guy, so I don't do things super by the book. You know what I'm saying? All right, let's get started. Done. It should last for a while. That really went by fast. The work is so much more efficient with two of us. Here, you take some too. It's perfect for a midnight snack, since it won't really put on fat. Okay, cool. I got a uh, athlete meal. I know your diet is important for building a strong body, but I'll admit I'm not much of a cook. I could use your help again sometime. If you don't mind, I might be able to try something more elaborate with your help. Okay. Maybe I should buy some pig's feet. I hear they're rich in collagen. Pig's feet? Oh, I didn't know you was into that type of stuff. That's uh, not my type of thing. But if you went to pig's ear, we might be on to something, Akihiko. I'm surprised because pig feet is like, it, it, what he said is like rich in, in, in it and whatnot. Some people don't like all the pigs. I, I, it depends. What do you want, Elizabeth? What do you want? You, you already told me about Tartarus. What do you want? What do you want? There is something I wish to discuss with you. So please come to the Velvet Room post haste. Post haste. I believe this matter is of great import to you. All right. I shall be anticipating your arrival. Okay. Post haste. Lizzie wants to tell me something important. What could be so important? I should head to the velvet room after school. All right, good. Alrighty. I guess I'm gonna have to go see her. More people's talking. Uh, people's always talking. The Carrizo group was on the news yesterday. Something about showing their true colors. Isn't that a miserable people? Carrizo. Oh, the student council president. I hear they're involved in a lot of things. Even the schools owned by the Carrizo group, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. That teacher probably got fired or something. Probably. She owns a school. Yeah. I wonder why a company that big decided to build a school. I mean, she got like, she rich, isn't he, right? Mr. was like rich. Yeah. Yeah, she is rich. That's a lot of money right there. Class has ended for today. Come to think of it, Elizabeth Vanshee, she has something to discuss with me. I should head to the vet. We're going straight there. I guess I am. What up? I've been waiting for you. You like the roses I gave you? Forgive me for calling you so suddenly, but there's something I must bring to your attention. There seems to be a human presence within Tartarus between floor 48 and 53. What? It appears to be someone without the potential who heard the voices of the shadow. Oh. If left alone, I feel they may, I feel they will become lost and may perish. Very well, then. Please find and rescue them. Missing persons report. report. Due to influence of shadows, civilians, c c c civilians will sometimes get lost in Tartarus and become missing persons. Missing person will, some, will be somewhere in Tartarus and must be rescued within a set time limit. In the event someone goes missing, details will be posted on the bulletin board in front of the police station. So keep an eye peeled. Ah, well, is it not why we have cops? Uh, I, uh, you know, I'm we're missing people. Is that true? 
Ah, I see. So there are people in your world who seek these materials. This, oh, oh yeah, the black, black book you seek can be found in the second block of Tartar's Aqua. I heard that the lustful snake that appear in the latter half of the block are quite fond of collecting them. <laughs> a material that captivates both shadows and humans, however, mark would be peculiar. Do any anything else? Are you accepting a request? Here's that sword you asked for. Bingo, this is indeed what I crested a fencing epi. As I mentioned before, an epi was used to duel in ancient times. Fencers will wear white uniforms so the blood from struck blows will be more visible. I have a request. And now a special quiz just for you. Do you know why my clothes are blue? Because it suits you? <laughs> I will ask my master for the correct answer. Please take this reward. Uh, okay. So you don't even know why yourself. Bring me protein for not pros. Uh, what's this? I would like you to bring me some protein that not only pros can drink, but amateurs too. I have a hunch that you may be able to acquire from my very athletic friend. Oh, well. I know someone. I know someone who will, uh, definitely have those. Uh, bring a bouquet of flowers. Oh, I never gave it to you. Didn't I do this already? Okay, bring me a potion. Uh, I gotta go to the nurse's office. By all means. So I gotta go get a bouquet of flowers. I gotta go get some medicine. Uh, get a sword. Get some protein. What else? Should I bring a whole building along with me? Very you well. like a whole entire building. Jesus. Alright, let's go ahead and get, uh, take care of this stuff real quick. It won't be long. It won't be too long. Alright, here we go. This is where I get the bouquet of flowers. Uh, rose bouquet. I can get a red pine bonsai. Mini cactus. Buff. Oh, uh, you know, glass vase. I think I should go ahead and get some of them. Might be someone. Maybe. Uh, you know what? Yeah, let me grab one. Uh, I like a flower vase. You need to take care of Get a mini cat. Yeah. There we go. Uh, what else? Oh yeah, I have uh, I have an art club now. Uh, shoot. Hey, well, wait, 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 check my phone. What's this? Uh, yeah, let's go to art club. Hi, I'm not sure if you remember me, but it's Hiraga from the art club. Kinda. You're not obligated to attend, but obviously. But it will help really nice. It will be really nice if you showed up. I'll be in the art room if you decide to stop by. Uh, sure, bro. I'll stop by. I'll stop by. <laughs> Is the, uh, hold on. I gotta go to the nerf office. I gotta get some medicine. What are you doing? Oh. Uh. It's the nurse office. Another thing it leaves me have to give her some potent medicine. Mr. Edgar might know something about it if I can ask him. Ask him. Yes. <laughs> we'll bring you to the nurse's office. Eh heh heh heh. Eh heh heh heh. You want, you want some potent medicine? I can't just give you potent medication whenever you want. Have you heard of the pharmaceutical affair law? No. What is that? You made that up? Hmm. It's an emergency and you absolutely without a doubt need my medicine. Okay, but if you're lying to me, I'll curse your kneecaps so they crack every week in the moment. Well, here you are. Okay, then. This is a special medicine I brewed myself, but I don't think I will call it potent. Uh, I got the medicine. All hey, right, all right. you got what you wanted, so off you go now. Okay. Hey, off I go, then. Off I go. Alright, let's go uh, to the art room. Hello. 
I'm about to head to the club. Are you going to? What are you going to do there? I feel like we can grow closer to the Fortune Persona. I feel like I might grow closer to her right soon. Uh, yeah. Yeah. For now, draw whatever you want. Just let me know if you have any questions. I can draw anything. Uh, the scratching of pencil echoes throughout the room. It's been so fun that hours flew by. Let's wrap up for today. Good work, everyone. Let's clean up and go home. Let's get on out of here. <laughs> Whoa, what happened, Fuka? Uh, what's wrong? <laughs> this has been happening a lot lately. What, you got the, uh, what, what's this called? The May Blues? I think they, they think that was called. It's not even May. the pain it might lead to serious complications down the road for you adoptive does anywhere else hurt are your nose and throat all right uh-huh does it feel like your head is in a vice what are you talking about bro you're not gonna scan the detail of fuka symptoms why are you gonna sketch it on your art book oh boy here we go case case and by strikes again now mikishi san won't be going anywhere for a while Strikes again. All right. If someone isn't feeling well, he always tries to figure out what's wrong. And it doesn't matter when or where. Once he starts, it takes forever. Case case senpai's dad's the director of a big hospital, and he's an only child. I guess he just can't stand to see people suffer. I bet he'll end up going to medical school. So the pain's originating from the back of your head? Could you turn around, please? Ah, don't worry. It's just a chronic tension type headache. Most likely the result of stress. You might be spending too much time in front of the computer. Try to get outside and exercise more. It must seem funny to get medical advice from the head of the art club. I was worried I'd come down with the flu or something. In that case, I can do a more thorough check. A thorough check? What are you talking about, man? Could you remove your shirt? Also, open your mouth and stick out your tongue. Open your sh wait, remove your shirt and open your mouth, stick out your tongue. Oh, don't talk to this guy no more. What? You don't. We shouldn't be talking to guys like this. Uh, that's okay. I'm fine. Besides, our dorm isn't far, so he can accompany me back. Yes, me, not you. Uh, sorry, sorry. Wait, you two live in the dorms? This is what you do in your art club meetings? I guess I see it in Yamagishi-san. She seems like a well-adjusted type. I bet you're a great cook. Hey, you Did assuming you too much, water? buddy. Is living alone hard? You assuming of us way too much, buddy. Uh, I think Hiraka has taken an interest in me. I feel like we've become better friends. It's more like taking an interest in Fuka. Remove your shirt! Open your mouth, stick out your tongue. It, it, it. Crouch down on the floor. Okay, I made that last part up, but still. Sorry, yeah, 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 yeah. This guy is just something off about this guy. This this guy right here. This guy. Here. This. I don't trust him. I, know it's close, but I think I that's why he's the fortune. Why don't I call you a taxi? A taxi? All right, bro. You trying way too hard. This is not even. Taxi ride might make your headache worse. Maybe a limousine would be better. Uh, that's okay. I'm fine, really. Man's trying to go the extra mile for some, uh, for Fuka. For Fuka. Again, dark outside. Yeah, because I'm about to head outside. I said goodbye to the club and I went back to the dorm. Yeah, seriously, that guy's, uh, boy. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I don't really know. Hmm. Alright, well, I think it's time. Uh, wait. You want some protein? Gonna start bodybuilding, eh? Mm. <laughs> I'm proud of you. I can give you something meant for beginners. 
amateur protein here it's called amateur protein it's specifically formulated for people like you like me which mean like me which mean uh, which, what does that even mean uh let me check the calendar uh you know what i'm gonna save here because i i've been going i've been going through it like crazy <laughs> Uh, we're gonna go into Tyrus real soon, real soon, real soon, real soon. We're probably gonna go into Tyrus in the next episode because I did not expect uh, to be doing more of the social link, really. Why we can't slack on our exploration of Tartarus if we want to solve the mysteries? It's important to rest and take time for yourself as well. You are free to go out and spend time with others in the dorm. Just don't stay up too late. Uh, okay, mommy. Jesus. Hey. I can't think about how Carrizo sent by drag Fuka into this. But Fuka really seemed determined to do her best, so I guess there's no point in dwelling on it. Instead, I just focus on doing my best to do good. Can I take my stuff out the fridge or somebody ate it? Ta the takoyaki I put inside here earlier is gone. A note is in its place. Looks like it's from the chairman. Dear Dirt, I apologize for eating your takoyaki. I had bought the same kind, but I forgot that I had put mine somewhere else. You mean you ate yours and you ate mine? I'll make sure to buy another one for you. In the meantime, please accept this as an apology. P.S. I hope you don't. I hope you don't find my love for takoyaki fishy. I'm not in no mood for jokes. I'm not in no mood for jokes at all. Wait, my stuff. Uh. Yo. Yeah. Yo. No matter the battle, a proper balance is to win is key. I just power mental strength, agility, and some luck too. It's not easy to train up each aspect, but if you keep experiencing what life has to offer, you'll get the training along the way. Yeah, sure, bro. My food been eating again. I'm upset. Uh, I'm just going to study, man. Let's go study. Let's study. Think about that takoyaki. I'm not even sure what takoyaki is. But I just, our picture is like, I don't know, like ice cream or something. So I think about it. I mean, you put it in a freezer, you chill it. Or it'd be like frozen fish cakes or fish patties. That's what I have. Oh, hello. What's up, morning? Morning. Uh, it's a beautiful day, is it not? How are you faring today? Not bad. Thanks for asking. Um... That's wonderful news. Sorry for being so awkward. I never had the chance to chat with someone on the way to school, so I got nervous. What, you never had friends before? But I think I'm getting used to life in the dorm. Plus, I'm pretty excited about everything we can do there. <laughs> Let's tend to the plants up on the rooftop again soon. Oh, yes. Again, yes. Again. Very soon. Uh, class ended. Uh, what should I do? Uh oh, Kenji want to hang out. You you blew you blew me off with some teacher. Uh, you know what? Let's yeah. Uh, let's do some sewing. I feel like in the mood to sew. I'm glad it won't be a full move for a while, but still can't put that. Okay, yeah, sure. Uh, Yo. skin. Yeah, right. Uh, yeah. Let's 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 do some sewing. We get to speak to uh Bebe and uh you see it and a bunch of other things. Uh so, so wait, that's Fuka over there? Hold on, wait a minute. Hey, that's Fuka, what's going on? Oh, are you on your way home? Let's walk home together, yes. Oh I'm sorry, I was about to do some research. I'm actually learning how to cook, but I'm still just experimenting. I don't think I make anything edible at this time, but I don't wanna waste your time. If I volunteer to help her, I might regret it. I don't have the courage to risk it. My courage would need to be badass first. I need to be. I need to build up my courage. Greetings. Uh, yes. Hi, baby. It's so. Kata, kata jikanai. Uh, you have a great sense for sewing. Please show me more of your skills today. Yeah, sure.
I really gotta build up my courage. Uh, uh, take a break for now. You have gotten much better at this. Subarashi, wonderful. Uh, Subarashi, yes. Thanks. I have to get better too. Subarashi. I am glad to have such a great Tomodachi as my rival. Oh, Tamadachi, uh, yes. Uh, Subarashi, Tamadachi. By the way, I have a question for you. I feel like this is like, this is kind of like OD, like, for me doing, saying this while my character is saying this to Bebe, which Bebe is French and not Japanese, it's, it's, I feel like there's cultural inception going on right now. I don't know. I'd like to make something Japanese, but what? Culture inception. I would like to make something Japanese, but what? Uh, what do you like? Why not worse than clothes? A kimono. Everyone loves kimono. A kimono! Yes! I love kimonos. Yes! It has to be a kimono! A kimono, yes. <laughs> kimonos are very hard to make. But kimonos are very sexy, though. I don't really know where to start. And the material is not exactly affordable. You just make it out of anything. Mm -hmm. I have to think about it. But I appreciate the advice. You are the only one I can talk to here in this country. As long as I have you, I will be okay. Daijobu. Daijobu. Uh, Tamadachi. Uh, Superoshi. Kimonos. Yes, you too, baby. Yeah. We're going, we're getting folks. We're, we're going close as our friends and we're learning words together. Yes. Oh la la, look at the time. I must make my way home now. See you later. Uh, see you later. <laughs> I really do like, I think Baby is a cool character. It just, it's, it's funny, bro. He's funny. He's like an exchange student who's trying. Uh, okay. Uh, what's this? Uh, I got enthusiastic about cooking for myself for once, but I bought way too many ingredients. I am going to have a lot of leftovers on my hand. Looks like Yukari wants me to cook with her. Uh -huh. Yeah, 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 let's cook. Awesome, let's go make something tasty. Cool. I picked up the ingredients to make chicken saute today, but chicken saute. Hey, I might have bought too much. I think my eyes are bigger than my stomach. I always end up having leftovers. What about you? Would you say you're a big eater? Uh, yeah, I love, I like, I like, I. I eat like a bird. I eat like a pig. Uh, I I eat like a pig. I guess. Oh, sounds like a healthy appetite. You're in luck because we've got plenty. I mean, I did eat the whole. I I did win the big burger challenge, so you know, <laughs> I do know. I, I know how to eat burgers. But... Don't get your hopes too high, okay? I haven't been cooking much lately. Well, either way, it'll be packed full of nutrients, so don't worry about that. They say your health is your most valuable asset, you know? I figured we should think about what we're putting into our bodies. And if I could lose some weight while we're at it, I'd kill two birds with one stone. But let's put that aside for now. Anyway, why don't we start with veggies? Can you cut the tomatoes for me? Yeah. I cut the tomatoes and the onions and the the, the, the green onions and the, all the other stuff. I made chicken saute with your part. It's good, good. It looks uh, good. It look well. Again, I said it looks good, but the taste is probably something new. I chose breast meat because it was cheap and I heard it's good for a diet, but it's kind of dry. Okay, very dry. I can barely chew through it. Ah, uh, dry chicken. It happens. Yeah was unexpected I don't usually mess up this kind of thing dry chicken happens you just gotta you know add more liquid to it i guess hey you're doubting me aren't you i'm serious i guess 
chicken saute. I'll make up for it next time. So let's cook together again when you get the chance. Oh yeah, no. It'll be so delicious. You can't help saying yum. I would love to say yum and not cough when I eat. Hopefully. All right, um, Saturday. I think this is a good. T well, hold on. More people talking. By the way, do you know Mr. Wakuri Joe, the student council president? Didn't you guys have this thing? This is how you guys started out your conversation like a couple days ago? I heard she's going to study abroad after high school, probably to prepare herself to run the Korea group in the future. Wow. Wow. That's crazy. It's like she lives in a different world from us plebes. But she's staying in a dorm, right? Why would a rich girl want to live in a dump like this? Maybe her family made her. To understand how us ordinary folks live or something. I mean, we are the ordinary people. We just need to take it slow. Mr. lives in a whole different type of, uh, I don't know, she rich. <laughs> oh, speaking of her, speaking of. I was just told that the chairman will be stopping by this evening. When you get back, make sure to come to the fourth floor. Okay then. I'll see you all later. Oh, there she goes. Talk about short notice. Maybe he wants to tell us a new joke. Uh. Who knows? But I am a little curious. I guess I'll head straight back today. Moro-chan, shake. Who is this dog? Arf. Oh, we did it! What a smart dog! That's a nice little dog. A, a good boy. A nice pooch. Oh, welcome back. Hey there. Uh, what's with the dog? He was passing by just a little while ago. Go on, Coral Chan. You know how to say hi, right? That's a good boy. A very good boy. Oh. His name's Koromaru. Koromaru. I've seen him sitting by the steps of the shrine. Oh, this dog still goes on walks all by himself? What do you mean? He used to belong to the priest of the Naganaki Shrine. Every afternoon, the two of them went this way for a walk. So that's what he was doing here. That is, until the priest passed away. Oh, damn. He passed away? Oh, you haven't heard the story? I think it was about six months ago. The priest was hit by a car while walking his dog. He didn't survive. Oh, that sucks. Ever since then, that dog has continued to go on walks, always stopping to sit by the site of the accident. Oh, what a good boy. But he refuses to let anyone take him in. Why, just the other day, my son. That's a good boy right there. I like Paramaro already. I don't really know anything about him, but it's a good boy. Very good boy, good boy. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, good boy. Oh my goodness, look at the time. I must be going. My son will be home soon. <laughs> oh, we'll see you later. Lady. Oh, you're such a loyal dog. The boy. Nah. Huh? Is he? What's wrong? Nothing. Sorry. More importantly, isn't the chairman coming today? We should probably go get ready. Yeah, you're right. See you later, Korochan. Boy, good boy, good boy, good boy. See you later. Hope we get to see more of that dog. I really like that dog. 
gathered you all here because I wanted to let you know how my research has been going. It concerns the shadows that have been appearing during full moons. Now, I want you to listen closely. It might be hard to follow. Shadows can be divided into 12 categories according to their characteristics. Wow. This we've known for a while. We can think of it like their class or order. I've classified the special shadows we've seen so far, and well, it's simply fascinating. Huh. Why are you so excited about it? So... Those four shadows belong to categories one through four in order of their appearance. On the four? They may have looked different than the more common ones, but the classification scheme still applies. What? what are you talking and about? That's something we should be excited about. Oh, I get it. There are twelve in all. And eight we haven't seen yet. Oh, you're talking about the the, the big ones. Those. That's exactly right, Yamagishi-kun. You're quite sharp. Oh, uh, okay, but what are they after? That's a good question, and that's what we haven't figured out yet. Their motive. They don't kill their prey. They feed on their minds. Their minds. Oh, then I guess that's how they become like after P. After P syndrome. Oh, that ooh, ah, uh, ooh stuff. Ooh. Now, it could be considered predation, but is it really? Is there actually an underlying intent behind their behavior? <clears throat> the purpose of the shadows as a whole. That's what we need to consider. This is interesting. But no matter what their intent, we still have to beat the rest of them. I agree. That's about all we can do at this point. Eight more, huh? Lucky us. According to the data, each one has been stronger than the last. That means we better start training harder. We'll manage. We've got plenty of time. But why does Tartarus even exist in the first place? Okay, uh, that was uh, all right. The puzzle pieces are finally falling into place one by one. Those large shadows that only appear on a full moon, I wonder what their purpose is. Uh, eight more remain. We have a long road ahead of us. Yes, well, there's that. Um, all right, well, I apologize. We there was no Tartarus in this episode, but we're literally going to go into Tartarus this night so we're gonna start on the, the next episode on the next part so anyway i hope you guys enjoyed this video again uh if you did go ahead and let you like share subscribe all that good stuff so you don't miss a single episode and i'll see you guys in the next video peace out and have a good one